Good day everyone and welcome to Slosh Mining. Today we're going to be going over how to create a Windows 10 installation flash drive and creating a Windows 10 installation flash drive from an ISO file or image file. Unfortunately you can't download the Windows ISO file from the Microsoft website but there is a tool to create a Windows 10 installation file from an existing Windows PC. All links and websites for the software will be down in the description below for you to download. First things first, we need to download the Windows 10 Media Creation Tool from the Microsoft website. Select the download tool now. Open up the downloaded software. Select Accept. Please note that depending on your internet connection and your hardware like SSD or normal hard drive, this process can take quite long, up to about three hours, um, to prepare the installation files, create the ISO file and write it to the flash drive. We're going to create installation media. to select both 32 and 64 bit onto one in this installation. We're going to select the USB drive. They do recommend at least 8 gigs. Um, I would go for the 16 gig as the file does get quite big if it's both 64 bit and 32 bit version. We'll go over the creating an ISO file at a later stage. Select next. Select your flash drive. And sit back while Windows does its thing. Three hours later, welcome back everyone. That took a bit of time. Um, well, I am running an i3 and 8 gigs of memory, so it runs a bit slower than usual. 99%, just waiting for that 100. Now to verify the USB installation flash drive. Make sure that all the files have copied over and none of the files are corrupt. Be right back while this flash drive verifies. Now as we get closer to finishing the Windows 10 installation flash drive and your flash drive is ready select finished and remove the flash drive this Windows 10 installation flash drive can be used to upgrade Windows 7 and Windows 8 to Windows 10 Plug the flash drive into your Windows 7 or Windows 8 machine. Double click on the setup file to install Windows 10. And follow the prompts to upgrade the operating system to Windows 10. The other way of creating a Windows 10 installation flash drive is actually by creating an ISO or image file and saving it to the PC instead of doing everything in one. The ISO file can then be saved on a server or hard drive for later use and you'll be able to use that ISO or image file to create the Windows installation flash drive. So we finished the process of creating the flash drive in one process, writing the ISO file to flash drive for creation. What we're going to do now is create a ISO file saved onto your PC for later use. Download the tool.
open the download. Select accept. We're going to create an installation media, but instead of USB flash drive, we're going to select the ISO file. So select create installation media, select next. We're going to select both 32 bit and 64 bit. Select next. We're going to select ISO file. We're going to save it onto our desktop. So the process will grab all the files from Windows 10 to create the image file and then verify the, the image file to make sure that it's not corrupt. Once that is done, the file is then created into the ISO file and which could be used to create a USB, Windows 10 USB flash drive at a later stage. And the ISO file has been created. Um, let's check the size of the file. Okay. As you can see, the image file has been created correctly and it's about 8 gigs. Um, just remember that this is a 64-bit and 32-bit version. Now that you've got your image file, the way that you actually write or make a bootable flash drive with an image file is we need to download the software to create a bootable drive. The software is called Rufus. I will leave the link in the description below to download the software for later use. We'll click on let's click on Rufus. Let's open up the file and see what we got. Do you want to allow Rufus to check for... Uh, yes, we can, but we're going to click on no. Okay, so this is the software. We've got a 16 gig flash drive. This is the one we just created, the Windows 10 installation. Um, a bootable. Bootable selection. We're going to select the ISO file. And the ISO file is on the desktop. We need to make it a bootable partition. Let's say Windows 10. Okay, file system, I'm going to leave on NTFS, we can't actually change it. And click on start. Yes, we know it's going to destroy everything on the flash drive. This is a lot quicker. And to burn the ISO file to flash drive. And this might take take a while. Be right back. To create a Windows 10 installation, flash drive takes about 24 minutes from an image file. Once that is done, click on closed, remove the flash drive. Plug the flash drive back in. And there you've got a Windows 10 installation flash drive. This can be used to either reinstall Windows 10, 
repair Windows 10 or install a new version of Windows 10 on a new computer. Please don't forget that one of our videos will be giving away 500 rands worth of Ethereum to a lucky subscriber once it reaches 1000 likes. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video. Ciao for now.